Hey guys, this is Cliff and Jeff from MyNicheDefines.com and here's a quick look at the new Google Play Store demonstrated on the HTC One. As you can see, the uh, Google Play Store now has a new um, redesign where your apps, your games, your movies, uh, books and whatever else is displayed in your region um, are now at the top and um, there's a different category view that I assume should be filled with things but for some strange reason isn't listing in there right now. Alright, so if you click on the app section you should see a list of um, the top paid apps by default displayed in a quick list there. It'll let you know if you have purchased an app already, if not it'll tell you the price and the rating. You can just tap on the card right there um, to see thumbnails and um, screenshots basically and uh, ratings and how many downloads among the other stuff as well. Um, it's all very nicely arranged right now. It looks very clean compared to the previous UI. Uh, you can see ratings over there, more apps by Disney, by the, the developer. And you can also see apps that users also generally viewed after installing this app. Um, so that is pretty cool. It does look very nice. Um, you can also swipe right there to see the top free apps, the top grossing apps, and the top new paid apps along the top new free apps um, and trending apps displayed right there. So all in all it's a very nice new clean design. Um, I like how it does tell you how uh, whether you have installed an app or not and um, the listing is very Google Now-ish um, in terms of design. So uh, you can also swipe back to the categories view which will um, give you more options in terms of categories uh, of viewing your apps. For example, in this case, you can view the education category to see more apps in that category. Um, so yeah, it does look pretty cool. I'm just going to go back to the movies view to just show you a quick look at how that is displayed. Um, in this case, uh, you can see the pricing right there for the movies. You can also see more information on how much it costs to rent it or to buy it. Um, along with the trailer right there and ratings. Um, so yeah, it does definitely look a lot cleaner. It also works a lot faster as you can see. Um, and lastly, there's the books view which will show you uh, the top selling books and various other categories right there. So yes, it does look very cool. I definitely approve of the new look. It is really nice. It really does follow um, Google's new look with their uh, design and um, it's very fitting into how the Google Now and new whole design team. Of course if you want to see uh, the list of your own apps, the ones that you have already installed, uh, you can just tap the action overflow button right there to see uh, all of your apps that are installed listed right there along with all of the apps that you have ever bought or downloaded right there. So uh, yeah, it does look really nice. Uh, you can also view your wish list for apps that you might have put in case you want to keep a watch over them, in case they have a discount. Uh, there's also the usual access to your settings. So yeah, that's just a quick look at the new Google Play Store and how it all looks and feels. It is definitely a lot better than the previous version. So yeah, this is a quick look at the new Google Play Store. As always, if you have any questions, you can let me know right in the comment section below or check out the detailed post or unleashthephones.com.